Hello, this is Mr. Chabry. Um, we are here ready to do some more Omega Ruby Wonderlock. Last time, uh, our encounter was this Magikarp, and I went ahead and put it in the party. It's level 25, meaning it's already about to evolve. Um, so, yeah, hopefully this thing will evolve. Um, and we're about to evolve Ninja as well. Um, so, yeah, once that happens, uh, you know, it's good to spread some experience with other Pokemon that's not currently a part of our team. So if we lose something, we're not set too far back. Let me go ahead and turn that on just so we can evolve Magikarp. Um, but we got to go back to find Steven. Uh, he was over here doing something, I don't know, uh, talking to his watch. <clears throat> yeah, once we get a specific item, we can make it our way to the gym hopefully and I think this person might want to battle yeah so we'll battle this person real quick uh, she might have water types because she has an umbrella yeah all right oh yeah oh I thought I put okay so for a second I, thought I had ninja up front but now I remember I was going to and I accidentally open the summary of switch so yeah anyway ninja can easily come in uh, fury attack why are you going fury attack I had a I had a rock type out here uh, we'll just mega drain get rid of this goldeen and I think ninja should evolve in this episode I think so Traveler's 33. Seeking, we'll just stay in. Um, sometime we'll have to evolve our Graveler. So that's something I want to do really soon. That did hardly anything. I mean, I want to evolve Graveler really soon. So I'll have to trade off sc off screen sometime. Trade the Graveler. So I can have a Golem. And Golem would be so nice to have on the team. Um, really nice to have. Anyway, now we just easily... Okay, let's make sure we do this while I'm thinking about it. Put Ninja up front. like a cut bush up here. Let me cut this bush. Is there a hidden item over there? Uh, I think there should be. See, it made me walk all this way. For a candy. Go ahead and pull up the uh, area now. So once I get to the next route, I'll know that we're officially on the next route. Um, the line noon. I'm gonna just run away from this guy. I don't feel like hassling with the line noon. Go ahead and battle this guy who's trying to look tough. You're not so tough. That Swablu. Okay, so he is kind of tough. Got a Swablu. I've got a Grass type. Grass type does not mix with Swablu very well. Huh? Let's get Graveler back out here. Cotton Guard. Boosting. It's defense, okay. Make it quite difficult, aren't you? Go ahead and rock to him. Takedown's doing nothing to us. Keep rock to I guess. Hopefully, uh, we don't have to worry about a bunch of cotton guards. Alright, so it might actually take itself down to recoil here. Oh, it won't. Okay. Do a little recoil. 
And one more rock tomb should do the job. <clears throat> good, 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 good. Birdkeeper Roberts has been defeated. Okay. Now we just travel here. <clears throat> and there's Steven. Hey, hey Steven, how's it going? We haven't really done much with the Mega Bracelet. Because the only Pokemon we have that can Mega Evolve kind of overpowered. So we'll just, can we just run from this guy? Yeah, just run from it. Okay. And there's no point in battling it. I mean, we're still on Route 120, so we don't have an encounter for this route. We've already got our encounter. Ooh, and we would need it that Sceptolite. Nice. All right, so now we can actually make our way back to or something. Yeah, let's grab this real quick. Nest ball. I don't know if it's going to come in handy, but it's good to have some free Pokeballs. Now we can go down here, grab that TM that's been catching my eye. Alright, um, grab the TM first. Then we can go into the gym. Grass Knot. Not the worst move. Got some really good use. We'll go ahead and give off this thing off. We'll have to use Moo Milk to top it off. Alright, let's go and get some battles done in this gym real quick. Alright, so this is a flying type gym, of course. Um, that's one of the reasons why I wanted to try to level Graveler up. I do have Luxray as well, and I've got Emolga. So I've got a few things that can handle... Oh, uh, these flying types. And we should be fine to rock to him. Oh, you would. You would. Okay. Um, just Smackdown, I guess. We just need to hit once, and then Magnitude will have a little bit better accuracy. Uh, we just need a Magnitude to hit. All right, there we go. I didn't want to rely too much on rock moves because they don't have good accuracy normally, and this thing just double teamed on me. This is quite annoying. Rock Blast. I think Rock Blast is a pretty decent move. Uh, let me see how much base power. 25 could hit quite a few times. Rock Tomb, 60. Uh, 50 on SmackDown. SmackDown's been helping me, though. Uh... So it needs to hit three times, and it's got more power than the other one. Um, I don't think I need Rock Polish. I've got Rock Tomb, but I don't really need Rock Polish. Ninja's level 36. Loet's 25. Magical Leaf. Okay, so that is a Grass-type move. I would actually be okay with Loet no. Magikarp should evolve. Fights way up there. Okay, Skarmory. Um, this would be so good for 
for Inferno. And Inferno, if, if Inferno was still here, it'd, it would be one of my best Pokemon. But unfortunately, we lost it way back there. Uh, let's Shockwave. Gonna be a two hit KO because Skarmory has really, really good bulk. Um, it's more of a physically defensive mod. That's why I did not want to stay in with Graveler. Graveler cannot really dent this thing very well. Such a bulky Pokemon. Oh, I, I mean, I could have you smacked down in the magnitude. That would have been nice. A uh, light screen. No, <coughs> Moga's got all the moves that it really needs. Um, I could use Nuzzle. Altaria, since that thing probably going to Dragon Dance. Um, here we go. We finally get a Sceptile. The Sceptile we've been waiting for. And now we've got a Pokemon that can Mega Evolve other than Latios. Sceptile is such a good Pokemon. So glad we went with Sceptile. Dolchop. What is Dolchop? That's a dragon type move. 40 power. Let's get rid of Quick Attack. I mean, Quick Attack's not that good. It's even weaker than Cut, and if we need to use something to catch, we can just cut instead of, you know. And here we go Magic Carp. Ready to evolve. Alright, so we got a Gyarados. And a Sceptile. Alright, and I honestly don't think we're going to need Gyarados. I just wanted to have Gyarados evolve so that way, you know, if it comes down to it, I need another water type. I've got one. With that, let's go ahead and switch some of our Mons out. We don't need the experience share on anymore. We are getting way too overleveled. And Inferno would be so good. I'm still kind of salty about Inferno going down back there. Inferno was so good. It was like one of the best Pokemon that we had. Alright, Gyarados, we only wanted you just for leveling you up. Let's put Ninja up because Ninja's not doing much for us in this battle. It could come in handy against Altaria if we need it to. We can like Mega Evolve. Go ahead and give it the set to light. Um... Make sure we got stuff. Just flying types. I don't want to use Pikachu. I mean, it's kind of weird having a Pikachu and also having the other Pikachu. Uh, since normally that would be dupes. But since we couldn't wonder trade the Osblay Pikachu, that Pikachu's still there. Um, so we'll just hold on to it. Cosplay Pikachu's been gone for a while anyway. We lost that thing to a trap hint. Made me sad. Uh, let's go ahead and run back up this way. Here we got something we want up front. Let Luxray get some experience. We haven't had Luxray out here in a while. That guy just looked away as soon as I ran by. Like he was trying to pretend he didn't see me. Oh. Alright, Swablu. Just easily Thunder Fang. Pretty quick, pretty simple. 
Right, now we have to do this little puzzle where we just go like that. Alright. Battle this person. By the end of this episode, we should be at uh, pretty much at Winona. I don't think we'll battle Winona, uh, Winona in this episode. I just want to make sure we get to one. But she's flying types shouldn't really be a problem. We've got a few electric types, and we do have uh, Rock and Roll the Graveler. Uh, Pelipper. Pelipper's nothing to Luxray. Luxray does not care about Pelipper. Alright, nice, nice. Look at all experience we're getting. Alright, we're almost there already, aren't we? Alright, there's another... Oh, this is a Dodrio, not a Doduo. Dodrio's actually a pretty decent Pokemon. Got good speed and good attack. Yeah, you're gonna see it outspeed us. It goes Pursuit. Why would I try to switch Luxray out? <clears throat> Why? Why would I do such a thing? Level 33. Do we get a good move? You know what would be a good move? Wild Charge. It's a lot of recoil damage, but... Battle this person real quick. We're already at Winona. Just defeat this person when we're there. And this person's got Pelipper. Not a problem at all. Just easily Thunderfang this thing. You know what? You're gonna protect. Are you kidding me, dude? Thunderfang. But we're almost there at Winona. So. I'm here. Oh, we gotta go up that way. We gotta do all that convoluted stuff. There is Winona. Um, we're going to end this episode here. Next time, we're going to face Winona. And get our... I think this is the sixth gym badge. Um, it's rock, fighting, electric, fire. Yeah, this is the sixth gym badge. So, if you like this, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. I will see you in the next Pokemon video.